How to factory reset your iPhone. I'm demonstrating on the iPhone 13. This will work for the iPhone X and newer. So what we're going to want to do is start off by going into settings. And this reset is going to clear everything off the device. So say you want to uh, trade in your device, upgrading it for a new one, whatever, or you're selling it, giving it away. And you want to clear all your information out of your device. First thing I'm going to recommend is sign out of your iCloud, your iTunes. Make sure those are going to go ahead and um, make sure that's out of there to get the full reset so it doesn't have that. Um, it's going to be not going to be asking for your information when you sign sign back in or you start or when the device gets started back up. So what you want to do is start off by going into general. From general, scroll down to the bottom and it's going to say transfer or reset iPhone. We're going to go ahead and select that. And down here, it's getting about, you know, uh, transferring your inform information over. If you haven't done that already, I would recommend doing that. Because once you delete all this stuff, it'll be gone. You won't be able to retrieve it. So um, right here, there's a reset option. And then there's an erase all content and settings. So I'm just going to go ahead and select erase all content and settings. Um, and it says erase this iPhone. Erasing will remove your personal data so that so this iPhone can be safely traded in or given away. So like I mentioned before, if you're trading it in or you know giving it away, selling it, whatever, um, the following items will be safely removed from this iPhone. And it's talking about apps and data, photos, videos, contacts, anything you have on there will be removed. So if you want to, you hit continue. If not, you hit not now. So I'm going to go ahead and select continue. And it says, are you sure you want to continue? All the data, media, and settings will be erased. This cannot be undone. Once again, if you have not already um, updated Make sure to do that first, back everything up, and then uh, go ahead and erase it if you're going to give it away or trade it in. So I'm going to go ahead and hit erase everything. And from here, it just does a little quick um, cycle of clearing everything, removing everything off your device, pretty much getting it ready. And then um, when it's all done doing this, it should be at the hello screen that you that you will normally see when you get a new device. And uh, the more stuff you have on here, uh, more contacts, more stuff that you're um, that it has to delete, it will take a little bit longer. On this one, the memory was fairly light, a few pictures, stuff like that, so it goes fairly quick. If it's loaded with a lot of stuff, it'll take longer to delete, remove, uninstall, stuff like that. So keep that in mind. And here we have the uh, Apple screen loading up. If you start this uh, reset process and you don't sign out of iTunes, uh, it'll ask for the iTunes. After you get to the hello screen, you start booting up the phone and it'll ask for your um, Apple ID password. So if you're giving it away, selling it, uh, trading it in, be sure to get rid of that information. Make sure you're signed out. Make sure to get rid of it. That way, um, someone's not going to be messaging you on a, you know, say eBay or whatever. Not going to be saying, hey, you're still signed into this account. What's your password? I wouldn't want to give out my password to anybody. So uh, just do this ahead of time. Make sure you are signed out of iCloud. So just like that, here we have it. We are back on the um, that startup screen. So I'm just going to go ahead real quick, jump through and show you guys that I was signed out and it's going to take me right back to the home screen. So I'm going to go ahead and set up manually. I'm going to type in my password. Have my type my uh, password typed in. Hit join. So I'm just, con I'm just connecting to the uh, internet. And that's the way that I'm going to be setting up the device just through Wi-Fi. I don't have any kind of data plan on this yet. So I'm just going to set up through Wi-Fi real quick. So just like that, I moved on to data and privacy. Continue. Face ID set up later. Passcode options. Going to go uh, don't use passcode. Don't use passcode. Uh, moving on. And it's asking for transferring everything. Don't transfer any any information because there's nothing there to transfer anyways. We just reset everything. Um, we're going to go ahead and set it up later in settings. Are you sure you want to use your Apple ID? No. Agree to the terms and conditions. Um, continue up to date. Not now. Disable location services. Don't want that now. Set up later in settings for Siri. Don't share. And I'm just going through this just so we can get to the home screen. So just like that, if um, you were signed into your iCloud along the way, it'll ask you, what's your Apple ID? It's going to say, hey, this um, iCloud is signed into this device. What is the password? And you'll need to type it in to fully reset the device. So you guys can see, no pictures, everything starting from stock, um, from like original, from when you got it. So just like that, that is how to factory reset, going through settings and just deleting all your uh, information. And it'll sign you out of anything. It'll delete any extra apps that you have on there. Um, I had photos and stuff in there. There's no photos, as you guys could see. So there you guys have it. That is a, my quick tutorial on how to do a factory reset on the iPhone 13. Once again, this will work on all other iPhones, iPhone X and newer. Keep that in mind. So that's pretty much anything without a, a home button. Um, hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you guys know anybody looking for this information, please do share it with them. Thank you guys all for watching. Have a good day.